What's going on the guys, Krakow here and welcome on this Saturday. Uh, first and foremost, I want to apologize to you guys for um, for not uploading yesterday. Uh, see, here was the thing. So I came home yesterday from the pre-admission uh, testing, like pre-operative testing, because uh, I have the surgery next week. So I came home, recorded some Battlefield 3, and I thought to myself, well, you know, I might record some Medal of Honor or some Call of Duty later on. But when I got on the game, it was just like I was forced to play, and I hate that feeling. I was just like, oh god, I'm tired, I don't feel like doing anything, I just want to lay down. So I kind of forced myself to play, uh, to record for you guys, but then I was like, you know what, my subscribers will understand. Uh, I'm just too damn tired, so I woke up today in the morning, and I was like, alright, so time to record some gameplay. So I hopped on Black Ops, and I was like, I, I still had that fucking feeling of, you know, that I'm forced to. So I took a break, drank, drank my coffee, hopped on Black Ops again, and I'm like, alright, let's do this. And I got the good feeling back about the game, and I simply recorded this one. So I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, this was kind of an unfortunate game from the first, uh, for the first couple of minutes, you guys will see why. I'm using the M14, one of my favorite weapons on my favorite map in the game, WMD. If every map is designed like WMD in Black Ops 2, I will be super happy. And these guys were total noobs, but they were camping noobs. <laughs> this was just crazy. Um, they were just going up, you know, up the ladders and, and up the towers in the back of the map. And I was just like, dudes, what are you doing? And look, look at this. One before my SR-71 and an RCXD from a ghost person and second chance user kills me. There was no there's nothing more annoying. And see, these were the types of noobs that they were camping, that's one, but they were prepared camping. Meaning that they all had claymores. And, uh, yeah, like, heartbeat sensors, I believe. Well, not heartbeat sensors, uh, motion sensors, I think, at the end of the game. But lo look at them. One, two, three, all the way up there. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna just pick you out. One, two, and three. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I was going for my, uh, I was going for my chopper gunner and dogs. Because I am running the high tier kill streaks. And I want to ask you guys, what is your favorite semi-automatic weapon from Call of Duty history? Uh, mine had to be the M14. Uh, from this one, from Call of Duty Black Ops. It has a really good hip fire ability, although when that guy was in second chance, I kind of missed, but still, you know, it has a better um, uh, hip fire, I guess, accuracy than the FAL in this game, and that's, I think that's a given. But the FAL is very good too. I know that a lot of people prefer the FAL because it has quote unquote less recoil, but see, the recoil on the FAL kind of goes left and right, whereas uh, on the M14 it goes from up to down. From, uh, yeah, from down to up. That's pretty much how it goes. Uh, the M14 is still very, very good uh, weapon in this game. And there's a lot of people on Black Ops right now. Uh, I, was, I was actually surprised. I was watching one of my friend's videos uh, where he was in a pregame lobby on Modern Warfare 2. And I saw like 180,000 people playing on, on Modern Warfare 3. Excuse me, on Modern Warfare 3, yeah. Uh, I keep getting all the Modern Warfare's confused, there's so many Call of Duty, so excuse me. So there was only 180,000 people playing on Xbox, on Modern Warfare 3, and I was just like, what the hell, man? What the hell is wrong? I mean, I know I'm not playing the game, but I didn't figure that so many people would transfer, o transfer back over to Black Ops. And it really is a huge jump. I mean, Modern Warfare 3 in its prime, when you went on Black Ops, there was maybe like 110,000 people playing on the PS3. Maybe like 150,000. And then, like, a couple of months later, I hop on Black Ops and I see 200,000. Then another month, like 220,000. So people gradually uh, went back to Black Ops. I don't know why, so don't ask me. Um, but it was weird. It was weird to me and uh, I was just surprised. So I don't even know how many people are playing Modern Warfare 3 on... And look, all those claymores. All those claymores and they all up there. Um, I don't even know how many people are on Modern Warfare 3 on the PS3. I'm assuming a similar amount, um, and, and that was on a Tuesday, it was a school day, so I guess the numbers were affected, but still, you know, at all times, when I was playing Modern Warfare 3, there was at least like 300,000 people, uh, you know, 400,000 people. The record for me, the most amount of people that I saw playing Call of Duty Black Ops was 1.2 million, like back in its heyday, back in 2010. Uh, when, like, I, I, I believe the first DLC came out, or the first double XP, and the most I saw in Modern Warfare 3 was, like, 700,000, so, I don't know, man. You guys can be the judges. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I got my chopper gunner, I, got, I actually got two chopper gunners and an SR-71 saved up. And I thought to myself, 
Well, I really want to call them in for, call them in for points because I'm grinding to get to 14th prestige. Uh, but <laughs> that didn't happen. Uh, I kind of um, I advanced to level 45 here, though. Uh, I kind of destroyed the entire enemy team. Uh, so there was nothing really they could do. So again, as far as ma map designs go for Black Ops 2, they will be modeled on Call of Duty Black Ops. So I'm very happy about that. I mean, that will change the pace. You guys have no idea how the design of the map affects the pacing of it. Obviously, on a map like Estate, it's going to be a slower pace. But on maps like Fire Range, it's going to be super fast paced. Also, there, well, actually, I'm going to get into that in my next video. How about that? So final score is like 30 something and 3, <laughs> 35 and 3 or something, 37. Uh, so hope you guys enjoy. Look at this, uh, my dog humping that guy. Uh, hope you guys enjoy. Please leave a thumbs up on this video, leave a comment, and I will see you sexy legends next time.